Okie dokie. So, teacher Larissa finished the page 87 with you last class, okay? Right? Okay. And started the 88. She started? Yes, but, uh, but she passed the reading and speaking to wrong work. And it's, so it's me. Okay, so, let's start over, okay? Let's start from the beginning. Is that okay? okay. Ooh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Sorry. Anyways, let's go. So reading and speaking. Can you read the letter A for us, please? Letter A. Read the dictionary definition of bucket list. Do you have a singular phrase in your language? Bucket list. Name. Bring. Bring. B R E. B R E. Known a list of things that you want to do before you die. Travel to India is number one on my bucket list. Do you have a bucket list? Bucket list. Mm -hmm. Things to do before you die. Mm -hmm. Do yeah. you have one? No, I don't have no? a bucket list. You sure? For example, I want to travel to this place before I die. One uh, I want to I want to travel to Europe. Europe? I die. Okay. Yeah. And New York before I die. Mm -hmm. And Yes. And that's uh, it. Show do ganja fui. <laughs> what? Cuz then show show do guns and roses ja fui. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, I have a bucket list here. Yes, right. Ali boas. That's it. Dá dá para fazer ela antes de morrer. Okay, so I have mine in here. I have many things that I want to do before I die. Você tem um aplicativo para isso? I have Pinterest. Eu tenho no Pinterest. Ah, ah, sim. Ah, porque eu não eu não uso isso não. I don't use Pinterest. You don't use Pinterest? It's yeah. awesome. I love it. So <laughs> things. What sorry. Do you, what do you do in Pinterest? You save pictures if you wanna make a different decoration at home. Mm -hmm. If you want to have inspirations to take I pictures. Saw, I saw many pictures in internet to in Pinterest, but I never. I never. I use it. I never use it. I use it for many things, for class classworks, for children, for example, worksheets. Mm -hmm. What else? I have a new apartment, so I wanted many ex many inspirations of things I could do in my apartment. That's right. I also made a projected. Um, cupboard, so I had to, to have some inspirations for that, so I use it a lot for many things. <laughs> so basically, what I have in my we have I have a to do list and I have things that I already did. Okay, mm -hmm. so here are some things stay in a log cabin for a weekend. Do you know a log cabin like those houses full of wood? Stay in a log cabin? A log cabin. No, I don't know what is a log cabin. A log, a log cabin. Do you see those American movies with houses made of, out of wood? Yeah. Aquelas casas yeah. de madeira? In the, in the forest. That's right. Those are log cabins. I, I went know. to one in Canada. So I already did it. Plant a tree. I already did it. Carve names into a tree. I already did it. Uh, walk behind a waterfall. Behind a waterfall. Uh, cachoeira. Andar atrás de uma cachoeira. Teacher, uh, right. what, what, the, what do you do? You, do you pass? What tip no Canada? How long did you stay in Canada? How long? How, how, long, long, it, how long did you stay in Canada? About five months. Five months. I did many things. I made a snow angel. What does it do you stay? 
the city yes it was a pretty 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 tiny i would say a village it was more like a village than a a, a city it was called Roxeter. it was three hours apart from toronto so it was a three hours car ride tipo assim três horas de carro from in, toronto in, in, in toronto uh, the people speak english and french no, in Toronto, just English. We don't see a lot of people speaking French. It's more in Quebec. Ah, Quebec. Ah, é perto, né? Ou não? Kind of. It's not so far, though. It's not very far. But in Quebec, is the French part of the of the the country. You know, they speak French and they only do it. <laughs> So I did many things in Canada. I made a snow angel. I built a gingerbread house. Gingerbread house. Gingerbread? Oops. Gingerbread house. Gingerbread é... é aquela... Não, é aquelas de... Aqueles, tipo aquele bonequinho do Shrek. Não tem o boneco do Sim, Shrek? É de biscoito, de biscoito. Isso, biscoito de alguma coisa que eu esqueci o nome. De gengibre, ginger. <coughs> I learned how to ice skate. Learned to... Ice skate. skate. Ice skate, patins de gelo. Isso, that's right. What else? I made s'mores around the fire. Então, botar os marshmallows na fogueira. This is a uh, very American. <laughs> uh huh. And I have pictures of that. Let me show you. I have pictures. In Toronto, have... in Toronto is not very cold. It, no, it's the closest part of Canada from America, so it's not the coldest part, but it is very cold. Very cold. But, it, but when I was there, the like the least temperature that I got was minus 40. Minus four? Minus 40. Yes, yes, 40. Yes. Eu já, eu já fiz já, é tipo naquelas nas províncias do. Porque há um tempo atrás eu tava querendo ir. Uh, look. Que massa. <laughs> These are my Canadian parents. Wait. Okay, made some s'mores. It wasn't cold at that time. It wasn't cold. So basically, um, because Ontario is the province, because they don't have states, they have provinces. And Ontario is the province that I stayed. Foi a província que eu fiquei, né? Ontario. And in Ontario, you have Toronto. In Ontario, tem Toronto, tem other cities that are famous, Mississauga, anyways. The, the, the place that I stayed, o que eu fiquei era tão pequenininho que só tinha 400 people. <laughs> 400 pessoas na cidade. Caramba. Não era uma cidade, era uma vilazinha, né? Uma vilazinha, um faroeste. É, but it, it was near to many bigger cities, tipo assim, tem umas cidades bem maiores em volta, então era como se fosse um bairro de uma cidade. Yeah, like a neighborhood. So, we had like Listowel, Goderich, Gory, uh, Wingham, many, many countries, many places, sorry, many cities. It was amazing, I love to stay in the county, county side. Eu amei ficar no, eles chamam de county side, que é o interiorzinho, né? Menino, tu passa assim, tu vê uma pastagem gigante, assim, com muitas vaquinhas. What else? Tinha como se fosse uma fazenda de porcos quase do lado da minha casa. Gostasse? É, bom cheirinho. Não, pior que não chegava, não. Ainda bem. Do lado, assim que eu digo, a minha casa era aqui e lá na frente era, né? Os porcos do Canadá coisa... não fedem, não. É só o brasileiro. Hã? Os porcos do Canadá não fedem, não. É só o brasileiro. Eu acho que é, Vis. É, né? Que eles ficam como se fosse numa casinha, tudo fechadinho, que é muito frio, né? Ah. Aí não sai o cheiro. Não sai. Menino, mas simplesmente eu parecia que eu tava num filme, porque minha casa era de esquina. Aí eu olhava para frente e tinha um negócio, um campo de, de milho. Eu olhava para o lado e tinha um negócio de milho também. Qualquer lado que eu olhasse tinha um negócio de milho. Isso de noite. 
nos escuro, só vendo a neve e a luz do poste, morrendo de medo. I have, I have, a, I have a, a big vontade. Não é vontade. Hum. Fui para Nova York no Natal, assim, no frio. Deve ser muito massa, velho. I mean, in Canada, they don't have, like, that big... I mean, um, Christmas is very important for them, but they just gather. They gather the family. Eles juntam as famílias. E aí, tipo assim, eles passam a noite de Natal juntos. Eles trocam presentes na manhã de Natal. It's very cute. É muito fofinho, muito bonitinho. Eles mantêm mesmo a mesma tradição. But New Year... Meu Deus, oh, é. se não fosse pelos meus amigos de lá, I wouldn't have done anything. Agora, eu years... acho, acho que Nova York deve ser muito massa, porque a gente vê nos filmes. Aí deve And ser... Toronto is very close to New York, it's very close. De yeah, Toronto você yeah. consegue ver Nova York. Eu já vi, eu já vi que é bem perto. Yeah, you can see New York and also, uh, if you go to... I went to Niagara Falls. In Toronto, in, in Toronto uh, have a tower that you, you. I don't have a tower that has a window in the bottom. But you subiu lá? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I did. Let me show you. Que massa, Let me find the pictures. Look. Ah, essa mesmo. <laughs> you can see the whole city. Around here, further is New York. Caramba. Oops. You can see like the buildings and everything. Let me show you. Look. Aí o, o chão é todo de vidro, né? In this part, no. But they have a part. And you can see in, under the CN Tower, you have the Ripley's Aquarium. Debaixo da, assim, abaixo da Sand Tower tem o Ripley's Aquarium, que é o aquário da, da cidade. Que simplesmente eles colocaram um desenho em cima no teto, porque quem tá na torre, no vidro, consegue ver o desenho. Hum. Ah, it's beautiful. Mas eu não tirei foto porque eu tava me, me mijando de medo, para não dizer outra coisa. <risos> But I went to the aquarium, look. This is me in the aquarium. Look. You go inside of a tube and you can see all the, the animals above you. Look, you can touch them. Is that a ballet? No, it's a... E quem disse que eu lembro a raia em inglês? But it's a raia. <laughs> Look, you can touch them. They come for you to touch them. Eles vêm mesmo para você tocar neles. Look. You're very, oh, the barum, 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 shark. Mm -hmm. You can go inside of a tube. It's like a, a, a tube and they go above you. Can you see? Okay. Here. Você entra num tubo e aí vai engateando e eles vão passando por cima de você. Que massa. Hey, it's perfect. It was one of the best experiences that I have ever I have ever had. Also, they have somewhere they call the Times Square of Toronto. Eles chamam a Times Square de Toronto. É o mais próximo de, da Times Mas Square, pode. que é tipo assim, é literalmente um quadrado com um monte de coisa em volta e tudo piscando. <laughs> é a Times Square dele. Times Square. But it's amazing. Amazing. I went to see the horses. Eu falei que eu tava no interior mesmo, meu filho. <laughs> Aos passeios que a gente fazia. Eu fui andar de charrete. Aí tá certo. Gostava seu massa. But that's it. I love Canada. Canada is one of the best countries to live. It's really, really, really cold. Really cold. Like, it can get very cold. Some people actually died. Because, like, a time of the year is very cold and the other time of the year is very hot. <laughs> Então, tipo assim, é uma diferença de 80 graus, velho. Que você vai do menos 40 ao 40 no verão. Entendeu? Uhum. Então, assim, é para poucos. É para poucos. É para poucos. You have to be prepared, because it's very hot or very cold. No, you don't have the middle. E eu cheguei e tava, tipo assim, 22 degrees. I was like, mm, it's awesome, not awesome. cold at all. <laughs> 
really good. I loved it. Keep it this way. Não deu uma semana. 12 degrees, 8, 10, minus 2. And I was like, I'm freezing. <laughs> Você vai, não dá para ficar mais frio. Aí depois aparece. <laughs> Não, primeira semana que eu cheguei, eu falei, menino, isso aqui que é frio, 22 graus, Oxi. vou tirar de letra, não deu uma semana, velho. Eu cheguei exatamente no final do verão, para o outono. Hum. E tava quente, né? Quente. No fim, tava quente, eu chupo, eu andando de chinelo no meio da rua. É engraçado, é engraçado nesses países que, tipo, verão para outono já mudou, né? <risos> aqui, menino... tipo, é a mesma coisa, é a mesma coisa. Menino, verão, outono, são dois países outro. diferentes. Inverno, lascou. Tipo, não tem... Basta é, mudar né? o dia que já mudou, né? Aham. Uh -huh. The day, the hours, meu honey. Meu honey, meu querido. <risos> meu honey. Oh, Jesus. Basta passar umas horinhas, jura você. É tipo assim, eu saía de casa, a folha tava verde. Eu voltava da escola, tava laranja já. É nesse nível, é muito rápido, muito, ah. muito rápido, você nem percebe. Com um pouquinho de estar laranja, já fica tudo cai. It's awesome, it's beautiful, é lindo. Tipo assim, eu peguei a transição das, das seasons, né? Que eu peguei o finzinho do verão pro outono, do outono pro inverno. Véi, não é por nada não, mas eu fui muito soltuda. Eu peguei os três. It was awesome, 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 awesome. awesome. I love it. Eu amei. You can tell, right? Dá para perceber, né? Que eu amei. Ah, dá para perceber. I love it. I love Canada. <laughs> But let's continue, okay? Oh, letter B. Read about me section and of Steph's blog. What does she say about? So, the Canary Island and Argentina, Australia and New Zealand, the IT company. Istanbul, Indonesia, Chile, and Prague having experiences in six months ago, in three months ago, sorry. Okay, so let's read about me. Can you read for us? Hi, I'm Steve, a traveler. Steph. For, Steph, a traveler for, from Germany with a passion for travel, food, and photography. 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 During my studies, I worked in a Canary Islands and Islands. In... We don't pronounce the L, the S. We say islands. And in Argentina, and I studied for two semesters in the UK. After I finished, I decided that I didn't want to work for the rest of my life. I was 21 and I couldn't imagine sitting in an office in an office for the next 40, 40 years or more. So so I decided to go to Australia on a working vacation visa. First, I worked for six months in Germany because I needed to save some money. I went to Sydney at the end of 20. 2011, 2011. Mm -hmm. I spent Christmas on St. Kilda Beach. St. Kilda Beach. St. Kilda Beach in Melbourne. I work in a restaurant and I and and then I travel all over Australia and New Zealand. After coming coming back, I got a job as a project assistant in a IT com company, an office job. I was happy to have a routine again, but I spent all my vacations traveling to Thailand, Istanbul, Portugal, Indonesia, Chile, Belize, and Morocco. Some months passed, but I but but finally I realized what I wanted to do with my life, at least for now. Having experience experiences is very important to me. More important than working in an office all week to pay for an apartment that I hardly ever spend time in and to buy things I don't really need. Three months, I, three months, month ago, I left my job. I decided to work in different jobs, sometimes here, sometimes abroad. 
sometimes as a volunteer, sometimes for money. I have a lot of dreams uh, and I want to make them come true. Very good. So now my dreams. My dreams. But actually let's do the, the other one first, okay? So the Canary Islands in Argentina. She worked there when she was a student. What about Australia and New Zealand? Australia and New Zealand. Working vacation visa? With a working vacation visa. First. And work is. Read about me and what does she say about? So what does she say about Australia and New Zealand? He says. I was uh, working in a restaurant and I travel all the over Australia and New Zealand. Yes. That's right. She traveled all over Australia and New Zealand. Sure. What about number three, an IT company? Um, she's, she's working as a job, a project assistant in a IT company. Nice. Project assistant in an IT company, that's right. What about the number four? Istanbul, Indonesia, chill and Prague. Um, she spent all vacations traveling to these places, Istanbul, Indonesia, Chile, Prague. Very good. What about number five? Having experiences. Um, Having experiences is very important to her. More important than working. Um, hey, isn't it? She think it's more important than working and buying things she doesn't really need. Okay? Okay. Three months ago. Three months ago, she, she's left her job. And decide, and decide to work in different jobs. Exactly. Okay? Okay. Now, let her see. Read my dream section. Check the five things you would most like to do. Compare with a partner and say why. That's right. So you're going to check what you would like to do, and we're going to discuss about it. Okay? Okay. You finished? Yes. Me too. So the number one. Number one, put put your secret in, ba in balloon and let it fly away. Let it fly away. Would you do it? No. No? I think I would. I would be like, call me when you find this balloon. <laughs> call me, call okay? Call me when you find this balloon. O que eu faria? Como é? Call me when you find this balloon. Call me. Ah, sim. <laughs> uh, number two. Go on vacation with my best friend. Would yeah. you? Yes. Me too, right? Yes. Three. Take a photo, a photo every day for a year. No. I don't. I, I would. Don't. 
I don't have this discipline to take a photo every day. I was forget. I was forget I to take a photo. To do it, I tried to do it once, but I forgot. <laughs> uh, next. Learn to windsurf. Windsurf. Would you? Windsurf. Yes. Me too. <laughs> I would totally do it. Five. Ride a horse on the beach. Would you? This is strange, but it's very cool. <laughs> it's very, very common in other countries. This is not common in Brazil. <laughs> no, not common. It's more common to ride camels. Mas como acha camelo do que... Then horses. But many people from other countries, até tipo assim, supermodels, they take pictures riding horses at the beach. That's right. Um, learn number six. Learn, learn to play the guitar. Yes. Me too. I would like to learn anything. <laughs> <laughs> Next. Learn a new language. Yes. That's right. Yeah. If you could learn another one instead of English, what would you learn? German. German? Really? Yes. It's Too very, hard to me. Very, it's very doido. <laughs> yeah. I would learn French. Okay. I, I would learn French. Yes, it's German and French. I French, would. Italian. So. I would. Um, read. Tá ruim para aprender inglês, imagina o alemão. Tá, rapaz, diga isso não. Number eight. Read on book every, every week. Would you? It's pretty hard to me read a book i wouldn't because if you read a book in one week you don't enjoy it é, se você lê por uma, em uma semana você gostou não? yeah you don't no but like you have to have a lot of things not to do tipo assim tem que ter pouquíssimas coisas para fazer né pois é, é isso. bem desafiador yeah uh, run, go run through a field of flowers would you no. I would. Tulips. And... Por aqui, por aqui é mais fácil você correr no canavial. <laughs> é pra acabar com o ser humano, né? I've never, never seen a field of flowers, but I see canavial every day. <laughs> I saw a field of corn. Does that it, count? It's a, thing, it's a thing very, very dream to see a field of flowers. They have a lot in, I forgot the name, but it's Holanda. Let me see. I forgot. Oh, é. Isso aí é só coisa de país desenvolvido. Isso aí não tem no ah, País desenvolvido foi ótimo. <laughs> oh, cada país tem o um field que merece, né? In here we have <laughs> sugar cane. <laughs> <laughs> sugar cane, cana de açúcar. <laughs> Caríssimo, viu, lá fora? Não dá pra correr. Very expensive. Uh, ten. Uh, learn to dive and take underwater, underwater falls. Would you? Yes. Me too. Smart. Do you know how to swim? Uh, mais ou menos. So, <laughs> Eu acho, eu, eu acho que eu, I, I think I'm not a fogo. Eu acho que eu não me afogo. But you don't drown. I never, I never, eu nunca testei. I never tested. I did. I tested <laughs> once. I almost died. Seriously, I almost died. Die, die sensation. Die sensation. I had, do you know that people say you see your whole life going through your mind? Like, through <laughs> you. I saw it. I thought I was going to die. Oh. I was in Pipa. I mean, I used to say I knew how to, to, 
to swim, but it's not very good. I'm, I'm really afraid that I'm not gonna make it. Tipo assim, eu fico com medo de não conseguir, aí eu não testo. <risos> Never tried it. Eu nunca fui o teste assim de não dar pé, não. Aí, mas assim, tipo, eu acho que eu conseguiria. Yeah, I was in Pipa. I was in... Uh, we were going to Golf Beach, Praia do Amor. We were trying to go there, but we saw a beach that didn't have anybody and we didn't saw we didn't see the red flags. Tinha umas bandeiras vermelhas, literalmente red flags. We didn't see. And we, we were in the, like in the very beginning of the water. I swear to you, eu juro pra tu que só tava meu pé dentro da água. But in Pipa, you have to be very careful because the sand, it, it goes away very easily. So it gets you. Menino, veio uma onda, derrubou eu, marido da minha tia, que tem tipo 1,80 e pouco, 1,90 e poucos, o, e o filho dele. Calma. Menino. When he, hold, he held me, he would, like, let his son go. When he could hold his son, he would let me go. Tipo assim, ele me segurava, o filho soltava. Ele segurava o filho, eu soltava. Nossa. E, assim, coitado. A pessoa, agora, é, né? Porque a pessoa não, não mar é pau. Tipo, se você não der, não der pé, não, não dá pé no mar e... e... E para você pegar na onda, assim, antes já tá arrebentando, o cara nadar para sair é... é ruim. Que o nome da praia era Praia dos Afogados, a gente não sabia? <risos> não sabia por quê. Que ninguém me disse. <risos> I didn't know, eu não sabia. But anyways, we, like, he, they got out, eles saíram. He, him and his son and my my aunt was like where is Bruna where is Bruna oh my gosh what's going on what did you do and I was inside of the ocean I was there I, just, I stayed there I it was one time that I got up and I only saw the blue sky and the blue ocean I swear to you I thought I was in the middle of nowhere não, Fraga. <risos> Juro a você que eu pensei, meu Deus, vou fazer um filme da minha história, eu tô no meio do nada. <risos> Ai, meu Deus. It was a crazy day, I remember, and I was like, almost at the beach. Eu já tava quase na areia da praia, eu fui nadando assim, né? Porque o que que eu fazia? Vi uma onda, eu descia, quando passava, eu subia e era quando eu respirava. Caramba, velho. O problema é que vieram três de uma vez. Aí eu soltei meu ar todinho na água. Quando eu fui levantar, menino, cadê que não tinha? Veio outra onda, me derrubou. Uf. Aí eu, sem ar já, tentei subir. Outra me derrubou. Quando eu fui na terceira, eu falei, me lasquei. É agora. <risos> Aí, menino, eu subi desesperada. Acho que foi a hora que todo mundo me viu, que eu peguei o impulso. Eu não sei onde eu peguei o impulso. Eu saí, que eu parecia... É... Sabe a baleia quando ela bota água pra fora, assim? É. Foi eu saindo dentro dessa água, a menina deu um grito tão grande que eu gritei que me visse e me puxasse. Eu tava desesperada. Aí eu was very, I was very close to the beach, eu já tava pertinho. Tanto que quando eu, senti, eu só senti uma mão fazendo assim, ó, vup, me puxou. Hum. Aí era um surfista, acredita que quem me salvou foi um surfista? Caramba! Jura tu, eu só senti uma mão assim, ó, vup! Aí quando ele me puxou, sabe aquela... <risos> Eu, eu faço piada hoje, no dia eu fiquei desesperada. Mas tu já viu o um episódio do Chaves, que é o Kiko se afogando na piscina para criança? Vi, não. É basicamente, ele tá na piscina aqui, tipo assim, pega só, sei lá, abaixo do joelho dele. E ele, ai, mamãe, Gente, eu tava quase pisando na areia, o bicho me puxou, eu botei o pé no chão, eu falei, eu tô aqui já. <risos> Jura tu, I swear to you, I was, like, I was needing a lot of water. Eu tava assim, morrendo de sede. Eu engoli tanta da água que eu só sentia... Eu sentia uma respiração, chega... Arranhava. O problema de se afogar é engolir água mesmo. O é. que mata a pessoa é engolir água. Não, me não falem não, pelo amor de Deus. <risos> Tell me about it. Diga me. Anyways, né? I'm alive. Anyway. Thanks to a surfer. Graças a um surfista. Porque se não fosse isso, nem aqui eu tava dando aula pra tudo. <risos> Tava lá, tu ia assistir meu filme, não ia nem sonhar. O filme lá, Bruna, 
afogada. <laughs> Where did you stop? We stop about the underwater photos, right? Go for a walk in a summer rain. Would you? No. Me neither. <laughs> Go to? A festival or an outdoor concert. Yes. I would totally. Like Rock in Rio, Lollapalooza, or even in Jean Pessoa, we have a festival with meat, with yeah. barbecue. Oh, uh, what else? Explore my hometown. My hometown is very, very, is very small, and I explore every day. Yeah. And I don't mark this option. You don't have this. <laughs> Would you explore Jean Pessoa, for example? Yes, every every weekend. Yeah. I, every weekend. You already do it. I, every weekend, I I ride a bike and then I explore the city. Mm, I don't know how to ride a bike. Can you imagine? Oh. I don't. I rent those those bikes that look like cars. Aquelas que parecem um carrinho. Em João Pessoa, da Bia. Meu Deus, aqui é um atrapalho na ciclovia. Oh, Jesus do céu. Ah, é Como eu difícil, tenho raiva daquilo. né? Duro pedal. Como eu tenho raiva daquilo, meu Deus. A pessoa querendo andar e o pessoal com aquele se arrastando com aquele negócio na frente. Aí é que tá, eu só consigo andar se for naquilo. Eu não sei andar de bicicleta. Foi a primeira vez que eu senti que eu estava numa bicicleta. Mãe também não sabe, não. Mãe também não sabe andar de bicicleta, não. Ah, you have to bring her to the beach and do that. Tem que trazer ela para fazer isso. Yeah. Ela vai sentir que ela está na, na, na Danão, não é não? Riding a bike. Uh -huh. It's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, menina. Do karaoke, would you? No. No, you don't like it? No. I love it. I hate karaoke. I love karaoke. Yeah. Uh, make, can you go 15? Make my best friend dream come true. I don't know what is my best friend come true. I don't know. My best friend's dream, right? I, I don't know when is my best friend. <laughs> who is your best friend? <laughs> yes, I don't know who is my best friend and I don't know what the dream, what her dream. Yeah, I totally agree with you. I don't think I would. I don't think I would um, make my best friend's dream come true unless the, her dream or his dream is for me to be rich. If it is for me to be rich, sure, let's make it come true. But uh, if it's not that, I don't know what's this person's dream. Imagine if it's me being dead. I don't know. Who knows? Yeah. What about the 16? Do something that scares me. Yes. <laughs> what would you do? Uh, okay. What would you do to scare you? Me, me assusta? Uh. I don't know. I don't know what scares me, but... I have to do something to lose the fear. Yeah, I agree with you. I've been to a Halloween field. I think that's how you you pronounce it, Halloween field. Basically, it was at night in the middle of a forest with people like in costumes and they would come up and scare you and be like running after you. And with those saw, saw I can like go straight. Bam! Chainsaw. Huh? Chainsaw. What was that? Mm-hmm. Menina, até castelo montaram lá. It's a Jason. It's a Jason. Yeah, they had Jason. They had. What's the name of the other guy with the mask? Freddy. No, it's the other one. Jason, Jason is the hockey mask and the chainsaw. Yeah, the chainsaw. No, no, but... 
is a letter face, letter face. Yeah, do do the letter face, yeah. Letter face. Yes, yeah, the, the Chinese soldier is a is a knife, it's a big knife. Yeah, they had both. <laughs> they had everything you can imagine. It was in the middle of the night, 9 p.m. Where 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 is in Canada? In Canada. Yes, in Canada. I didn't know where I was. I didn't know that city. I didn't know anything. It was in the middle of the, the forest. You only had your cell phones. Like you only had the the like the lamp of your phone. You don't you don't see anything. It's in the middle of the night, no lights. People Jason scream. appears and let her face appears to scare you. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yes, and they would run after you. Eles correm atrás de você. Tem um negócio que era tipo uma caixa que você passava e pisava no lugar e fazia pá e pulava assim. Você... Jesus Christ. Nossa. I loved it. Imagine, I loved it. Loved it. Nossa. It was, I think it was the most scared that I ever got. Because like we know it's not true. But at the same here, time... Here in, here in Brazil, if you... What is if you do this these things? <laughs> People would kill you. Yeah, so let me na cabeça. Uh-huh. Yeah. But, and it was a lot of with a lot of mud, muita lama. Eu fui de volta. A sorte que a mãe da menina sabia que era com lama. Tinha chovido. Olha, eu quase caí na lama. <laughs> Because we would run, a gente corria, né? Meu filho, não interessava quem ficava para trás, a gente ia embora e eu quase fiquei. Oh, Jesus. What about the number 17? 17. Make all the recipes in recipes? A recipes in a cookbook. Would you? No. I would. I like to cook. No, I don't like to cook. You only like to eat. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I imagined. I love, I don't have a cookbook. My mother has a book and she writes the recipes. So I like to do her recipes, but I love to cook. I don't, I just don't like to clean. I don't like to do the dishes. I don't like to cook. It's very boring, but I have to, I like to eat. <laughs> yeah, so if you like to eat, you have to learn how to cook. Or... You have to marry or date someone who loves to cook. Does, I forgot her name, Samara? Sabrina. Sabrina. <laughs> Sorry, Sabrina. <laughs> Does she like to cook? Uh, I think it's, uh, um, no, Sabrina, no, Sabrina, Sabrina's life is very, is very busy. busy. Then, then uh, she don't have time to cook, to have time to many things. Então, é aquela corre-corre. I can imagine. <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> não, I can não, imagine. Não, 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 não. I don't know either, but uh, the same is with you. You go to João Pessoa, come back to your city and do all of this stuff. Your lives are very, very, very busy. Really busy people. Yeah. So, the last one. Getting a taxi and shouts, follow that car. Would you? No. <laughs> I would in New York. I would do it in New York. <laughs> Jump in a taxi and be like, follow that car. And then the, the taxi driver will be like, follow that car. Follow that car. It's a it's a Hollywood film. Follow the car. Uh, I saw in Canada they were recording movies. They record? Mm -hmm, they were recording. In Canada? In Canada. In Toronto. I don't know what movie it was, but they they closed like a street. You know, they closed a whole street so that they could film there i loved it it was i felt like i was very famous 
I don't know if I am part of the movie. I just feel like I am very famous because I was there at the same time they were recording it. I don't care what says. <laughs> I think I was a, I was a big big Canadian actress and mm -hmm. <laughs> very a famous, famous, one. famous Canadian. Canadian, Canadian, Brazilian actress and Canadian, Brazilian. That's right. That's the correct name. Canadian, Brazilian. I am. I. I don't know if it was exactly this, but I think it was for the Fast and Furious. Canadian? I don't know. I don't know if it was. I don't know if I'm mistaken, but I think it was. I don't know. <laughs> the Fast and Furious is uh, very strange. Uh, he's he's. He do, é. Yes. Das. E, sei lá, eles fizeram um filme que disseram que era aqui no Brasil, que tinha um trem bala. This is Brasil. Brasil. This is Brazil. This is Brazil, é, parece mesmo. But I don't know, I don't know if it was Fast and Furious. I just know that there were a lot of like police cars and explosions and stuff stuff you know and they were filming i loved it i was feeling famous i was like excuse <laughs> me i'm going to pass if 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 it was if it was fast and furious i think is is filming in canada and and they say this it was Australia. tokyo <laughs> in tokyo <laughs> yes yeah. I believe in you. I, I totally agree with you. <laughs> so I will let you go a little bit earlier today, okay? Because it was just me and you. So I'll let you go earlier, okay? I believe it's going to be... Falou muito rápido. I will let you go earlier. Vou te liberar alguns minutinhos mais cedo, okay? Because it's going to be just you and Elio, maybe. Se não for você e Elio, vai ser só você e Titi Larissa. Okay? Okay. I'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.